Okay, everybody. I'm going to head out to go to a couple of resale shops. Maybe see if I can find some garage sales. See if I can find some old hero hooks like I like. So I thought I'd take you guys along. But since I'm at home still, I'm going to show you the... Just show you what my flowers are starting to bloom already. You remember I showed you my video on my flowers. Uh, I cut them all back. Like I said, you should. Now they're all blooming out. There's that one. I don't know if I showed you guys that one, but... This one's starting to vine out and bloom. This box, actually... I gotta get something for it. It's full of roly polies at night and they're eating my plants all up. So I gotta do something about that. I cannot let little bugs eat my flowers. <laughs> so those are starting to bloom out. They're still little yet, but but they're just now starting to bloom because I did cut them back. But it won't be long, they'll be real long and hanging over the pots. These white ones are really turning out to be really pretty, I think. They were super cute. They're not all the way opened up, but they really match this black vine well. And here's the fountain. It's really starting to bloom out, too. Now, I, this fountain, it has drainage holes because all your pots could have drainage holes. I, I made sure the water drained before I put plants in it, but it's starting to bloom. I can't wait for these big pink flowers to spill over right here over the top and those should hit the ground it's so cool but yeah they're all doing really well I love these they're, st they're so big petunias I just love petunias so I just want to give you an update on those there's a wasp over there he's like I love petunias too see him right there I think he lives here somewhere I'm not gonna hurt you wasp all right, so I'm gonna get going in the in the van. I just wanted to show you the flower update that they just started blooming, and pretty soon they'll be spilling over that fountain and spilling out of the boxes and out of the pots. And you ready to go, babe? Yep. All right. Ready. Oh, in the wheelbarrow out here, it's starting to bloom too. I guess while I'm walking in my van, I'll show it to you. What are we doing? Going to get the Going to see if we can find some garage sales. Yard selling. Yard selling. And they'll all be spilling out soon, too. They just started to bloom, too. All right. I'm going to go ahead and get in the van. I had to stop at this place. As I told you guys last night on my live feed. It's an Amish store. Look at these donuts. Got me some cannolis. Homemade cream horns. Look at all them Danishes. They are so good. We're going to eat all these before the kids get home. Before we get home to the kids. Apricot. Oh. Amish makes some good stuff. I love them. All right, we're gonna go get hit some garage sales and eat these donuts. Okay, I already wolfed down one of them donuts because that's my weakness, yarn and donuts. So now we're at my local Walmart. So I'm gonna come in here and get some stuff that's to get rid of those roly polies that's eating my plants. And I can't really come here without looking at the yarn. So we will stop by there. He knew it. He doesn't care. He's pretty patient at the yarn aisle with me. I do love to look at plants, though. Look, they got wisteria vine, Derek. We have a wisteria vine at home. It's huge. I actually found it before. This one's pretty. We got a pink one, though, at home. We should get this purple one. Yeah, this one's nice. See, I love plants. I, small wisteria tree. I like wisteria trees. And you can tame this to be a tree. That's fine. You just gotta find a main trunk. They're like this one just has a main trunk. It's hard though to do that. They keep reaching. Yeah. Look at me. I treat plants kind of like yarn. I always gotta look, don't I, babe? There's those. I enjoy this one. He likes plants more than yarn. I like plants too, a lot. I wanted one of these dappled willows too. These are pretty. Why do these say wisteria? They're not wisteria. They're dappled willows. That's weird. They're just mislabeled. Yeah. These get those little pussy willow cat, cat pins on them. Yeah, right cat there it says. Cat tail looking things. Ten bucks. We should get one. Plant it um, over there by the, in between the pine trees. It's going to ring up this mysterious though. No, they'll ring that up. Uh oh. That tag on it says willow. Yeah. Want me to get one? I don't know. It's up to you. I do like them. They're pretty, but 
They got pretty pink leaves on them. It's a shade plant. No, they're they're shade and sun. They 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 can tolerate. They're real hardy, hmm. like a willow is. Well, let's keep let's looking. Think about that. Let's some grapes and stuff. I get carried away with plants. We have there's a lilac. We don't want to get a lilac. We have so many trees and plants in our yard. I'm gonna have to keep reminding you how many we have. He has to remind me that hey, we don't really have room for that. <laughs> but I got a little bit of donut right here. I got donut on my face. I don't care. <laughs> it was good. Uh, but one thing I don't have is a lilac. Look at this one. This one's pretty. Pink one. That's pretty. I said, hell yeah, I want oranges on it. I don't think they have orange ones here. I looked the other day. They only had pink and white. Huh. Here we go. Huh? Yeah. I want to look at real king though. They usually have better ones. We got blackberries. We have blueberries. What happened to them? I don't know. I've planted them three times. I think the blackberries are. We need more acidic soil for them. We got like our, our grapevines are going crazy all the way across the wow, fence. Let's go look at their annuals over here. They're petunias. Walmart don't always have the best petunias, but these better homes and garden ones <clears throat> aren't bad. They're not as good as the proven they winners. Don't get as big. Yeah. They don't get yeah. Look at these uh, gerber, gerber daisies. I like gerber daisies. But you know what? They just don't bloom for long. That's their only downfall. They're beautiful though while they're blooming. Geraniums, I like those. Alright, let's get and go look at the yarn, I guess. And give me some roly poly repellent. I just like something to, uh, I don't really want to kill them. I don't keep them, away. keep them away. I'm not much on killing anything that's living on our planet, but. Yes, we like roly polies. Like I like roly polies. I just can't have them eating my flowers because they weren't cheap. And that's where we draw the line. That's where I draw the line on insects eating out my stuff. We might have to bring one again to them. But we, <clears> we hate to. Yeah. I, I don't kill spiders or anything that's in my house. We always just let them go. Well, I'm not going to lie. I kill mosquitoes. Yeah, we do kill those. <laughs> They're nasty. Huh? It's got a bad rap because they break your blood and spread disease. Yeah, they're sickening. Let's go this way. Yeah. Hi, Charlie. How are you? Oh, yeah. Excuse us. Okay, is this the insect repellent? No, we need to go over here to the next one. Now, let's see what we got here. It's fertilizer. fertilizer. Oh, wait, wait. I, let's go to the next one. Here they are. I think if you don't mind killing all the bugs, this bayer is the best one that you can get. We have this. It's just for slow and slow. I don't know. If... I'm going to use... Is ours old? Oh, yeah. We also uh, give the snails the slugs this, too, because they love the petunias also. Does that get rid of a... Is ours old? Because we need that. Because I'm going to start getting slugs on them, too. No, I think it's a... Uh, we just got it last season. Huh? Like, <coughs> isn't there something called diatomaceous? Diatomaceous. Wasn't it this? No, that's not it. I mean, there is something... something diatomaceous earth, and it's rough to them and whenever they crawl across it. Like for the slugs. Yeah. They, they don't like it, so they don't crawl across it. So it doesn't kill them. It's... Right there it is. Oh. Let's read about it. If it works. It kills these. Cockroaches? Ew. Yes, it does kill Ants, them. Just, silver I just fish, read where it was rough to the underside. But... <sighs> I might have to get something that just... That's more like... Gets rid of them. I hate to do that, but... See if that bear right there has... um. One of these bear ones has uh, roly polies on it. I hate to kill them like that, but man, I can't have them eating my flowers. I hope you guys understand. 
Don't judge me on that. I'm sorry. I don't want to do it. I don't see anything that's humanely going to get rid of roly polies. I seen on the internet where you could put. This, this doesn't harm bees, or. It doesn't harm what? Bees, the honey bees. Oh well, yeah, but does it? It doesn't say actually. It just says. Uh, Here, I'm gonna stop the camera for a minute and look at some of these. Okay, I couldn't find anything that was just gonna shoo them away. I had to get this. It was, the it was the only one that listed the roly polies. It sucks. I don't want to do it, but I feel really bad about it. But I don't feel so bad. Gonna... Last night when I went out there and they were, so it was like, I'm not joking, like 200 of them on one plan. I'm like, all right, I don't feel so bad now. <laughs> so let's get that, Eric. That'd be nice when the. I know. Okay, let's head to the yarn, I guess. Check it out. You want to get a cart? Cart? I don't think we do. I wish they'd put that. We'll see if they have any yarn in the clearance section. That mandolin clearance here. I'm waiting for days. For months. They ain't got nothing good here. Clearance. Yarn. I don't see any yarn. Hmm. All right. There's some sheets for a dollar. You don't need them, but man, it's hard to pass up Walmart's deal, isn't it? You could probably sell those on Facebook for three dollars. I ain't selling them. <laughs> I'm just selling. Let's go. Kids want us to get another pool, but we're not going to. So people were asking me if I had a pool, and I said we used to. We got rid of it though, but I'm not going to get another one. Yeah, we had a huge pool. I'm going to show you the cutest thing. Pool. Yeah, the, pain, the pools are kind of a pain to keep up with. Plus, with our little ones, I don't really want to get one. The cutest thing for Evelyn, look at this. It's one of them ride-on toys. It's a six-volt ride-on. She saw it and went crazy. Isn't it adorable? A little unicorn that she can ride on, and it moves around like a power wheel. Comes with a little stable. It's so cute, but it's expensive. So... I couldn't get it for her. Clark would have yeah, Clark would probably chew it up too. Has Clark got food? Yeah, we just yeah, bought him a bag. Good. And cats got food? They got, food. They got, litter. They got litter? Greg's, Greg's got, got food? food. Okay. I always say that every time we pass the pet aisle, make sure all our pets got what they need. Olivia never tells us when the cats run out. Yeah, she tells us. She's supposed to. She's in charge of feeding and watering the cats. And Isaac's in charge of feeding and watering and cleaning Greg and he's always really good about telling us when he needs litter or Greg needs food. Olivia never tells us until it's too late and we have to right run back. Right after we go yeah, to Walmart, right after we, we, go to Walmart so we get home she's like, oh the cats are out of food so we have to come back. I know you don't mind. I don't. We always end up here. Put this on clearance. Oh, enough already with it. Hmm. They're going to eke it out to the very end. They so are going to eke it to the very end. Most of them are already all the tore up anyways. Yeah. My yarn aisle is a little empty today. You know one color I don't have is the stripes right here. The primary stripes. No, it's neon stripes. That's not the one I'm talking about. I don't have that one either, but... That ain't it either. It's all tore up and... Sure. Hmm. Do I don't know if I need anything. No, I know I don't need anything. I was gonna really say. But Probably sometimes sure. my wants exceed my needs. Hmm. I'm sure you'll use all that yarn in your lifetime. I doubt it. You know I got a yarn problem, babe. <laughs> it's better than having a crack on it. It is. I'm going to pass on that Bernat Pop. Which one is this? I already have that one. Same thing. The way I look at it, you're just... The yarn just brings out your creativity and it inspires a lot of people. So it does. I it's hope good, it... It's a good thing. That's all I ever want to do is inspire people. You know, I don't have... I don't know. See, the thing is, I don't know. I got so many men colors. I can't remember which ones I have. 
I came here the other day and I got, huh? Should we write it down? Take I know. Pictures of it. I came here the other day and got about eight skeins of mandala, and I came home. When I went home, I already had some of them that I'd already that I just bought. So now nah, I'll just keep it and get more. <laughs> I love you, babe. I know you do. And my yarn addiction. <sighs> it's pretty warm out to be getting this wool stuff. I like, you know, I like scarfy. Is this not, not 398? Is it? Oh, that's the mandala. I'm like, if that's th Scarfy's 398, I'm getting it. That's a good deal. Yeah, that's one bad thing about our, our Walmart. It's always mislabeled or mispriced. Isn't See, it? this ice cream yarn is 347. When I installed it at Hobby Lobby, it was like 450. So it was a lot more. I don't really need no cotton at all. I hate scrubby. I'm not getting that crud. I gotta get something. I can't come here and not get something. Yes, you can. We're getting this. Seven, oh. seven dust. There's I seven know. Dust. It's yarn, man. I'm... That's pretty. Yeah, but you should go home and write down the ones you have. I know I don't have this one. I think. No, I don't have that one. I don't have no scarf, you believe it or not, on my shelves at all. Really? I've used what I had, and I haven't rebought. I'm going to buy it online because they got prettier colors. I've been looking at Joann's and stuff. So no This is the first time you guys are ever going to see me walk away without, without a skein of yarn in my hand. It's very hard. I'm not going to lie. It's not that hard. They don't have a lot of new It's stuff. hard, man. I don't care if it's new. I can just see these colors and know I don't have them and think that I need them, even though I don't. <laughs> Hey, I don't need yarn, but I like it. What if you don't have the color, then <laughs> you have to add it to your collection? Stash. See, you know. You get me, babe. I do get you it. get me. I got to add it to my stash. And I know I don't have this one. Oh, yeah, I do. Pixie. I just keep it grounded when we're in the yarn. Aisle. I don't have this one. Wait, I might have that one. You should write those down. Because I need to look at the names. Because when I look at the names, I think I have, I don't know. I don't know which ones of these mandalas that I have. Here's that. I don't know if they have. I know I don't have any unicorn. But their unicorns are so tore up. I looked at them the other day. See them? If they put them on clearance, I'd buy them. But. Could we use this for crafts? Yeah, I think they use cheesecloth for, for crafts. Not any crafts that I do, but. Do you see any more of these unicorns with the pink center? Besides that one, that's not that's all tore up. I'm not buying it. Which one? This one, this pink one right here. I'm 100% certain I don't have that at home. Here, or a white center. Oh, no, this is a gray center. Oh, that one's got a pink center. It's not as pink as the rest. But I could use this one first and then head into that one. Let me see that gray one up there you got, because there's some down here with gray centers. That's a light gray. Okay. Got to get your centers to match. If you didn't see my video. See, I'm not buying these skeins that are all tore up unless they give me some type of discount. We should go find the lady that's, that's in charge. And be like, hey, give me a discount on this yarn that's all tore up. And then I'll take it home and I'll take extra special care of it and make it look like brand new again. Reroll it. What? The unicorn? No, I don't. I don't have it. I don't think I do. I don't I don't know for sure. But I don't think I do know. It is pulled out weird. These three are pretty close. You can't always get them to Why are they all tore up? I don't like it. I don't like my skins tore up. What comes after the white? The gray? So if I use these two, this one, the white? yeah. Pink? Or oh, right after it? Is white. What comes after the white? Gray. Light gray? Yeah, like that lightish blue is gray or whatever. So I could use this one first and then go to this light gray because that's what comes after it. Yeah. 
Okay, I'll get these three. I don't. Ah, oh, it's upsetting. So you lied. You're gonna have to cut that part out of the video where you said they're gonna see you walk away with nothing. I know. They knew I wasn't gonna walk away with nothing. My followers know my yarn addiction. I want to find the lady in charge of the yarn, and I'll be like, hey. How much you give me for this whole end cap here? A tore up mandala. How, how much can I give you for it? I'll give you $50 for all of it. She'd be like, ha ha, no. <laughs> I mean, it's probably like 100 skeins there, ain't there? 15 skeins is $50. All right, I'll take those three mandalas because I know I, I don't. Oh, are you telling me? Oh, yeah, I'm telling you to get them. I know I don't have that color. Like I said, I don't know how to. Okay, I walked away with yarn. Yeah, I can't help it. I did. Where are we going? What do you have to get? Well, we came here for the roly poly stuff. Yeah. Didn't come for yarn, but we were leaving with yarn. Which yeah. Is okay. I, oh, we never come here for yarn, and we leave with yarn. I thought there was something else we need. Toothpaste. Toothpaste. We're out of toothpaste. Here, I'm not. I'm gonna shut this off. You guys don't want to see us shopping for toothpaste. I'm sure that's gotta be boring. Okay, we went and paid, and for some reason, that seven bug spray we got. They said they could not sell it to us because it was on recall. Yet it's still <laughs> on their shelves. So we have to get something different. It's kind of kind of weird if you ask me. Look at it all. Yeah. The same stuff. Well, let's see what this kills. Can they sell us this one? Oh, they want to sell us the fourteen dollar one instead of. That's one. what it is. What That's, is this one? It's the same stuff. It's just like. Why would it be granules, though? Why would it be recall? And they still just have it on their shelves. Oh, this is liquid. What's going it's on? I, I just want something in this. Here it is again, right here. Here's where I got mine right there. No, that's not where I got it. No, I must it have got it's that one one. Ugh. That's frustrating. Oh no, this is fourteen dollars. It's the same. This is the hand stuff. That's the same stuff. Yeah, so is that. Okay, let me look around. I'm gonna turn my camera off again. What's this one? Does this kill? I'm not sure why they would recall it and leave it on their shelf. So that don't make no sense. I mean, it must do something super bad. It is an insecticide, so you, everybody knows to take caution with it, but. Okay. Let me look. Okay, I was, I was able to get the same thing, except for it don't have the spray trigger. I guess the spray trigger on the other one was recalled. Maybe it sprays you in the face or in the eyes. I don't know, but I didn't want to get it, so. But we got the same thing that you can just mix in water. And water your plants with it, so I that'll people work. People inhaling it when they sprayed it. It's weird. And it was causing lung damage or something. Well, I don't want to get nothing like that. But yeah, me neither. At least we were able to get the same thing. Just, just have to mix it. Here I am looking at flowers, like I look at yarn. The flowers are so relaxing. They are they're beautiful. Plants are. Beautiful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I like these too. These are pretty. Yeah, I like the hen and chicks. They're not bad. I'm not a big fan of these little six packs of plants though. I did get some marigolds, but other than that, it's Alright, we're gonna leave Walmart. You guys are probably bored with us. I haven't found any yard sales yet. Yeah, we're gonna go look around for some more yard sales, I guess. Magnolia, I already got a magnolia. What's that one? Forsythia. Oh, there's the white Forsythia Bay, like my mom has. Oh, yeah, like that one she has in the front here. That's a spirea, I think. Yeah, that's a spirea. Pretty. Pretty, pretty. Yeah, they turn red in the fall. Yeah, it's really red. Pretty plain, though, during the summer. I hope I'm not making anybody sick with my bad camera skills. Alright. 
I'm gonna turn the camera off. Okay, Goodwill store now. Let's see what they got. Maybe they got a big bag of yarn in here. My Goodwill never has no yarn, and when they do, it's overpriced. But I'm sorry for my bad camera skills. I need to get some type of a camera stabilizer. Camera camera stabilizer for when I do videos when I go yarn shopping and stuff. That way, you guys won't be vomiting from motion sickness from my video. <laughs> I know some people can't even watch them. They want to, but they can't because it makes them sick, which I completely understand. Okay. Yeah, I don't like their shoes here. I'm gonna go look see where they would have yarn. Let me go over here to the women's clothing section. I'm gonna go over here to where the yarn's at. I don't have any. It's pretty empty here today. Well. Hmm. Nothing, nothing for me. I guess I'll check their shirts. I'm gonna turn my camera off for a minute. Okay, I'm back. The only thing I really got on my trip was these three skeins of mandala, the unicorn, and I didn't have those, so now my mandala shelf's full. And I got all my donuts that I wanted, and I've already horfed down another one since we got home, so. And I haven't eaten any. Hey, that'll change soon, don't worry. So, thanks to everybody. I'm going to turn my camera around here in a second. For... So, thanks everybody for coming with us. Sorry it was kind of a boring trip. I know that it was. So we didn't do much. Mom didn't have much yarn, but thanks for tagging along. Couldn't find no garage sales for some reason. It's Friday and it, there wasn't any anywhere. But, um, I'm going to take you guys along next time I go to a big yarn store. So, Thanks for coming with us. Bye-bye, guys.